Hello, and welcome to another edition of Business Automations with Ben. Today, we're going to be exploring the LinkedIn integration on IFT. If this is your first time hearing of IFT, welcome. At IFT, we help solopreneurs and small business owners by connecting the tools that they love to use every day. If you'd like to learn how to automate your business, simply like this video and subscribe for more of this content. And just in case you're not already familiar, LinkedIn is a professional networking platform platform where individuals and businesses can connect with one another online. And I'm going to show you an automation that's going to help you stand out as a thought leader in your given industry on LinkedIn. For this first example, let's pretend that we have some type of job in big data. It could be a data scientist or a machine learning engineer, or perhaps just some type of data analyst. Okay, so after a quick Google search, I found this website called Dataflock. That's D-A-T-A-F-L-O-Q. And here it says, learn everything you need to know about big data. Find out how companies are using this revolutionary technology and what it means for your business strategy. Next, I'm going to right click here and select view page source. Do the command find function and type in feed. Hit this link here. This is our RSS feed on the back end of this website. So we're going to copy this. Now we go to if.com and in the top right, we select create add. Search for RSS feed, like new feed item. And here's where we paste uh, dataflock.com slash v, create trigger. Now we hit the plus sign here in the middle, select query, and we select the AI social creator and generate a social media update for a blog post. The main things we wanna change here, starting with platform, we of course want it to be LinkedIn. Wanna get rid of all this in content and simply add ingredient, entry content. Leave the link as entry URL. Anytime we put something on LinkedIn, we want a professional tone, create query. Now it's select then that, type in LinkedIn. We wanna share a link. And the only thing we wanna change right here where it says, what would you like to comment about the link? Click add ingredient and then hit this drop down the top right. Select generate a social media update for a blog post. Again, this is the query that we just created at content and create action. Continue. And we can, of course, name this app at whatever we'd like. I'm going to call it Big Data News to LinkedIn. Now let's pretend that we're not actually into big data. Instead, we're a climate change activist. So I found this website here called YaleClimateConnections.org. Going to do the very same thing as last time. Going to right click, select view page source, search for fee. We're going to select YaleClimateConnections.org slash fee. Copy this here. Go back to if.com and hit the create button in the top right. Again, start with the if statement here. Search for RSS, type our feed in there. We create trigger, add the same query as last time, generate a social media update for a blog post on LinkedIn. And again, we then share that link with the query that we created for AI on LinkedIn. Continue. I'll call this automation climate change articles to LinkedIn. So the applets that we just created haven't actually fired yet, but I did want you to see what this could look like as a result on LinkedIn. So here's a post from a similar applet that I created using a website called hotnewhiphop.com. Basically, this post is telling us about a new sneaker release that's coming up. It's a lengthy post, very professional, gives us the date of when the shoe is gonna be released, gives us the price, gives us the link to the article, and it even adds um, some very appropriate hashtags for this post. Thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you got something to say, let us know in the comments. Also, you can click the link above for more its videos. And remember kids, I said it once, I'll say it again, automate your LinkedIn.